It may look like a regular SUV, but a closer look will tell you that something is missing from this truck on display this week at SEMA. Where's the tailpipe? It's kind of t difficult to see, but if you look down in here, you see the UQM drive motor down underneath there. This production SUV from Phoenix Motor Cars runs on battery power, has a 130 mile range, and tops out at 95 miles per hour. Finally now, after five years of work, and really a lot of uh, progress in this last year, we've ended up with the sport utility truck and the sport utility vehicle. Both of those pack an amazing 400 foot-pounds of torque from zero RPMs and can recharge in as little as 10 minutes. The secret, of course, is the battery. We uh, took traditional uh, lithium-ion um, design technology, replaced the graphite in that with our own uh, nanotitanate developed material. We're a nanomaterials development company and one of the benefits of uh, nanotechnology in a battery configuration um, is that it um, acts as what's called a zero strain material. It means that uh, the uh, lithium ions can literally deposit and, and, uh, on, on charge and then uh, extract themselves on discharge um, from the electrode materials without straining the overall material. One of the big effects of that is that um, the battery therefore has um, a very long life to it. But by removing the graphite and carbon content um, from the battery, it removes the safety problem that's inherent in traditional uh, lithium ion batteries. So uh, we find that our batteries don't exhibit the thermal runaway characteristics you normally find so, in so a traditional lithium ion. So they don't burst into the flames. No, it's a, it's a you know, very, very safe technology. And obviously, in a, in an application like this, an electric vehicle, I mean, it's that's of paramount importance. Is that the last thing you want to do is put a large number of batteries in in there uh, that potentially have a safety problem associated with them. Other G Wiz features include a carbon fiber drive shaft that weighs a feather light five pounds. Reporting from the 2006 SEMA convention, I'm Ben Chertoff for PopularMechanics.com.